Okay, so this weekend has been huge, just enormous. So Sarah came down for the Renaissance Festival. That's the biggest thing that went on. And while we, th we were there, I bought a bow because I took target archery years ago and I liked it a lot, but I hadn't been able to afford a bow. Well, I realized I wasn't going to be able to buy my computer, the upgrade that I wanted, until I get my tax refund. And that's several months away, and in the meantime, I still have that extra overtime money that was kind of lying around, so I wanted to do something with it to keep me occupied. So I bought a bow, and I'm going to set up a target archery range somewhere out here, because I live out in the country, and you can do that. I'm just trying to figure out what kind of backstop I'm going to use for the target, because I've not settled on that definitively. I'm not going to buy one professionally because it's just not worth it when I have so much cardboard lying around. Somebody's been hoarding cardboard. So now I just need to figure out exactly what kind of backstop it's going to be. It's going to be either layers of cardboard or it's going to be a cardboard box that's stuffed full of the polyurethane bags like you get at the grocery store. I haven't finally decided that yet. I'm probably going to explore both a little bit and see which one works better, but the cardboard is certainly easier because I already have all the materials lying around. Now, the that's not the only thing that happened, although spending that much money was a big deal, and it's going to keep me pretty occupied. I also think that I'm going to have a tutor student or two that I can work with. I'm not making as much as I'd wanted you know, as I previously did as a professional tutor, but right now it's more about just doing something satisfying rather than it is making money. So I'm, you know, okay working for much, much less doing it just because it's satisfying. And also I get to help people, which technically I do in my job, but it's not the same. There's much less interpersonal interaction and you definitely don't get to see the growth. So there's that. Tutoring is looking good. I'm also, I happen to stumble across a new pump, so I don't need to design my own pump for the solar still anymore. So I have jumped leaps and bounds ahead of where I thought I was going to be. And it's exciting, partly because it's nice to be able to solve a problem with money for once, rather than having to solve it myself. So now I can go back to doing what I wanted to do with the solar still and quit being stuck on the pump. I'm also getting one of those bumps at the first opportunity. Also, I happen to meet somebody new. They seem kind of cool. So we're going to try hanging out and see what happens. They're a gamer, so that's nice. Also, they're kind of... It's one of Amy's old friends, so I'm excited about that. One of my friends referred me to a job hunting person. They helped him find his job in engineering, and I'm like... That is exciting. He put me in touch. So he did. So I'm now kind of talking with someone who seems kind of skeptical that I'm qualified the way that I say I am. But I am. And also, there's Thanksgiving coming up. That's the biggest problem I have is that my current job doesn't plan that far ahead. So I don't know if I'm going to have Friday after Thanksgiving off or not. I'd like to have it because it would make life easy because then I could do stuff. But until I get definitive word one way or the other, I'm going to have to assume that I'm going to be working that day because I don't get holiday pay if I don't work the day before and the day after if I'm scheduled. I can request Friday off and then Monday is the day I have to be on time. But I have to work exactly as scheduled. So it's up in the air what I'm going to do then. I also realized I have the opportunity to do some algorithms in, on my computer for my windmill. I realized I have all the pieces to just do that. Yay! I get to be an engineer. And also, I have... I can't remember what else. It's just been so much. It's been crazy. And I'm looking forward. I know Sarah's coming down this next weekend. I'm hoping I can get her to play Magic, partly because you can interact a little bit more over a game like that, and partly because at the fair there's a lot else going on and you don't get the same interpersonal interaction. Same thing I just said, right? 
but I also picked up a tutoring student, so I should be seeing them soon. But I feel like I'm repeating myself now. I probably am. This is good enough. But life is good, and I'm moving forward.